Yes, sir. We'll get right to it. Bye. What's up? So the big guy up there just created this new thing called humans. Is that like a new species of animals? I guess. But anyways, he wants us to come up with the genders like we did for animals for reproduction purposes. Male and female. Done. Good work. Works for me. <laughs> <laughs> he says it's not creative enough. He wants more. More than two? Don't question what's up. And it's humans, by the way. Mm -hmm. Try gender. People who try a gender? No, no, no. People who identify as male and female and their gender. And the third gender is? They only have the idea, not the content. Cis gender. Wait, what happened to the other five? What? No. A cis gender is someone who identify as the s they were assigned at birth. Wait, did you just create a word that means normal person? I like that. Why do simple when you can do really, 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 really complicated? Do all gender. You do all? No! Do all. Someone who sometimes identifies as a male and sometimes as a female. What? Here's an example. Oh no! This toilet is only for ladies and I have a <laughs> No problem. Let me mentally switch to my other gender. Oh, all good! <laughs> and then I walk in the toilet. Demigender. I like it. Someone who partially identifies as one gender and at the same time with another gender. How is that different from dual gender? It is. How? It is. It's not. Give me something! It is. It is. I still don't see how. But... As long as it is. And gender. No. What's that? Someone who identifies as all genders. Wait, didn't we already have that for both male and female? No, 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 no. All genders. Male, female, quail, ginger ale, 50% sale, epic fail. They identify as all of that. I really don't understand. Which is why it will work. Hit me with the pen. Xenogender. What? They identify as anything but human. Ah. What? They identify as flowers, plants, animals. Ah, so do they come as bouquets, plots, or do you find them at the zoo? All the above. Are they civilized at least? They can't. They're too busy being woke. Bi gender. So people who say bye to their genders, like bye gender. No, bye as in two. Oh, I thought you meant like bye as in goodbye. I'm a goodbye. Are you? Yeah. Oh. Non binary. Not male, not female. So they're nothing. Yes, but don't tell them that. Why? Because we are making those extra sensitive. But what if I accidentally say sir? Oh, instant protest. If I correct myself and I say sorry now. Oh, instant protest. And if I say sorry? Oh, instant protest. But I just said sorry. Yes, but you can't assume they're sensitive. Whoa, 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 aren't we going a little bit too far? And that is just the beginning. Wait, wait, wait. If it's not male or female, then we can't say he or she. We could create a new pronoun or use an old one, such as they. That's for when there is more than one. They are one. It's one of them. So they is? Because they is alone. Are they? Is they? Shut up. Wait, so now we have to ask people what their pronouns are? Yes, for example, my pronouns are he, him. Okay. What about this lady? She, her. What about this Chinese lady? She, she. What about Michael Jackson? He, he, he. What about this sneezing guy? He, she. What about this Chinese lady singing Billie Jean while sneezing? She, she. He, he. He, she. What about Netflix? They dumb. What about this black? This is just me talking, and I don't mean to offend anyone, but what if I accidentally miscall someone's pronouns? That would be labeled very disrespectful. Hey, you wanted to make it sensitive, not me. That's by accident. So what, should we get every human born with a pronouns card so that we know what to call them? No, because it's how they feel, and you can't label feelings. You know what? This is very confusing. You're a man, let's leave it at that. You'll be hearing from my lawyer. Them, it, em, ver, zem, her. All the above. Okay, this is just me thinking out the box, but just hear me out, okay? New genders, male, female. Does this gender create problems? Nope. Will it protest on the street and complain to the public that life is unfair? Nope. Then no! Humans who don't create problems aren't humans. Thank you, sir. We'll get right to it. Another project? Yeah, he wants us to create colors for humans now. Wait, like what we did for dogs? Like mm -hmm. many colors, many races? Whoa, 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 whoa. I will make that word sensitive. Be careful. We create different kinds from different parts of the world. And do we at least make them hate each other because of their differences? Optional. So yes, we do. Hey, remember our new motto from the previous scene? Humans who don't create problems aren't humans.